reason that animated films are often some of the biggest box office successes of the year. It's because their stories and characters appeal to and move fans of all ages. Here are the nominees for Best Animated Feature Film. The Adventures of Tintin. You mean the poem? Yes. The poem written in Old English? Yes. I don't have it. I will find it. With or without your help. Arthur Christmas. Cars 2. Mama! <laughs> Don't worry, Mama. McQueen is very sad. I will beat his cry baby bottom today. And there's the insult we were missing. Puss in Boots. <laughs> Rango. Where does that come from? We kill a man before breakfast just to work up an appetite. Then we salt him. Then we pepper him. Then we braise him in clarified butter. And then we eat him. And the Golden Globe goes to... The Adventures of Tintin. <laughs> Accepting the Golden Globe for the Adventures of Tintin is director Steven Spielberg. Well, thank you very much, Hollywood Foreign Press. Wow, this is fantastic. Um, oh dear, okay, before the music starts, let me just say, because a lot of people are contributors to any film that's in animation, I want to thank all the other uh, nominees and... Uh, I'd like to thank my partner, Peter Jackson. I would like to thank, um, thank you very much. I'd like to thank uh, two studios that really uh, proved the adage that Peter and I could make the telephone book if we wanted to, because Sony and Paramount gave us a chance to turn this 80-year-old series of wonderful books into a motion picture. So I want to thank Amy Pascal, Michael Linton, and I want to thank Brad Gray for his courage. And. Thank you. And uh, uh, Daniel Craig and Simon Pegg and Nick Frost and uh, Jimmy Bell and of course the, um, the man of a thousand digital faces, Andy Serkis. Thank you all very, very much. Thank you to Kate. I love you. Thank you.